Wrestling Federation, coming to you from Hollywood, California. I'm Alan Bolte, celebrating 29 years of announcing wrestling and boxing in the West Coast. And we have a near capacity crowd tonight. We got a huge crowd tonight, but we would have a full capacity crowd if Johnny Payne, yours truly, was on the card. Yeah, you got Mr. Outrageous, you got Moses Grimm, you got the Hardcore Kid. The Ballard Brothers. Yes, you do, but you got Johnny Payne, now known as John Blake, the world's greatest natural bodybuilder, doing the announcing with you tonight. Well, thank you, John. And on top of that, we've got lady wrestlers, some great ladies action. We've got some tremendous high flyers and the most exciting event of all in wrestling, a 16-man over-the-top battle royal. Exciting, but don't forget dangerous. You go over that top rope, you hit that floor, you just might knock it up. I've thrown many a men, women, children, referees, dogs, cats over that top rope. Cause I love to watch them splat. I don't care if they get up. Let's go to ringside and our ring announcer, Michael Zerilla. Hey, Joe Brody.
is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, weighing in 160 pounds from Denver, Colorado, Naya Kennedy! She weighs in at 120 pounds from Boise, Idaho, Carla Jane!
once again, weighing in at a combined weight of 400 pounds from Los Angeles, California, they are the team of Colossal Chris and the whole effing Lucha Show, Steve Payne!
Talk about tremendous wrestling action. We have seen some amazing matches so far. You've seen some great wrestling tonight. In fact, the only time I've seen better wrestling is when Johnny Payne was in the ring. And I used to have to carry Mr. Outrageous to and from the ring, around the ring, through the ring, because we were tag team champions a while back ago. Speaking of wrestling, Johnny Payne, tell us a bit about your wrestling background. Well, as you mentioned earlier, I was trained by Mad Dog Buzz Sawyer himself. I wrestled around the world, from coast to coast, BWE, NWC, and like I said, UWF Tag Team Champ with Mr. Outrageous. Who's going to carry him tonight? The Ballards? The Hardcore Kid? There's some good talent. But I don't know. Hey, tell us about your, your history. Well, I've been ringing out sir, since way back, that's right, since the late 70s. Introduced such greats as Andre the Giant. Hulk Hogan, so many more up to today. It's an exciting, 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 tremendous sport. Speaking of exciting, we've got a 16-man over-the-top battle royal coming up next. Let's go to ringside.
USA, USA. It looks like this is shaping up to be USA versus the world. It reminds me when I wrestled, Alan, it was always me versus the world. But they don't have me out there anymore, so now it's the other USA wrestlers versus the world. And here we go, it's Battle Royal time. You're right, Alan, it's starting fast. They're going at it, they're throwing blows from corner to corner. Check that one out. There is so much talent in the 16-man battle royal, I wouldn't know who to put my money on. We got Hardcore Kid, Outrageous, we got the Ballard Brothers, Impossible to... I'm putting my money, Alan, on Cole Dawson, but I'm waiting for Cranes to get hurt, because I think I'm going to move in on his manager, Jessel. I believe <laughs> I, it. I like that look. It's impossible to keep your eye. It's like a three-ring circus. There's action all over the place. There is so much action going on in these battle royals. Tonight, this 16-man battle royal, I don't know where to start. We're going to let you relax and just try to take in all this excitement. And I'm enjoying it, Alan, because Mr. Outrageous has got kicked. <laughs> He's been kicked a few times in his career. He can take it. This Balor from outside the ring, choking Outrageous, even using his own Canadian flag. Oh, Alan, he's not choking Outrageous. He's trying to wipe the sweat off for him. He's being a nice guy. I don't know why Balor's helping Outrageous out there. Oh, come on. just got thrown out. Hey, Alan, go over and see if he's hurt. I'm going to go talk to his woman. <laughs> hey, come here, Jessel. <laughs> hey, Alan, I think they took your flip-flop out of the back because they're beating it, mother. <laughs> you better go in there and get it. Elbows, chops, forearms, kicks. Now look at Black Metal, he's 265 pounds, putting the boots, trying to kill and choke the man.
Uh-oh, we got the Ballers. Looks like they're turned on each other. What happens if they're the last two in the ring? They got to go at it, Alan, just like Family Feud. There's no friends here, and I like it. Talk about clever. The Ballers, very experienced wrestlers. This whole thing was a scheme. Look at that. Alan, it was all a setup. Whoa, look at that. There goes Big Moses, about 270. I'd say he was about a biscuit away from 300, but that was my former tag team partner, Outrageous, that threw him out. I taught him that, you know. He could never do that himself. Oh, good God, he hit the floor hard. They're calling for the stretcher, Alan. They're calling for the stretcher. This is my favorite part. Watch this. I'm sure you've been in the stretcher a few times in your career too, John. I'll stretch you, Bolty, if you don't watch it. just got eliminated. He's a tremendous athlete, a worldwide superstar. All right, Alan, all right, calm down. That's the name of this game, Battle Royal over the top. Now, wait a minute, that's not fair. It's called payback, Alan. Pro wrestling doesn't have to be fair. Tremendous double drop kick by the Ballard brothers. That's the way Outrageous and I used to do it. Well, I threw my drop kick high, he threw it low. It's taken five guys to get Michael Madness, the big man from Alaska, out. All right, now we're getting down to the wire. There's only five left in the ring. Who's it gonna be? It looks like we're getting down to Canada versus Mexico. I don't know if I trust the Ballards so much for NAFTA. Well, now the fans are chanting outrageous, outrageous. I love it, Alan. I love it. It's even getting me excited. Outrageous, outrageous. Who's going to be the winner? Look at this, Alan. Look at this. He shouldn't have turned his back on the Ballards. Outrageous is going to pay big time. That was a big mistake. Yeah, this could be it for Outrageous. Oh, double elbow. Big double elbow. Outrageous is down. He's going to pay, Alan. He's going to pay big time. Anything can happen to the Battle Royal. Outrageous in the ropes. Double! Good God! Double clothesline, Alan. Outrageous, you can feel the pain. He's down. Yeah, I don't think he's getting back up. Well, the Ballards are going to help him up. That was nice. They sure up. are. Into the ropes. Double backdrop. That was a big double hip toss, Alan. Get your moves right. Hang around with me, I'll teach you. Double hip toss, and that hurt. The fact is, he's hurt. I think he's done. But the Mexicans got something else in store for him. 
What's this? How can outrageous take so much punishment? There that you go. That was a big double backdrop, Alan Bolton. That sure was. You can hear that from the whole arena. Backdrop. A backdrop that Pat Patterson would have been proud of. Outrageous is down and hurt. He may have to call it a night. Well, the Ballers are helping are, him up again. And yeah, they sure are. They're all smiles now. Oh, good God. Big elbow. What, what are they doing here, Alan? Looks like a, almost like a camel clutch. I remember the shake. Oh, he's in pain. It's Outrageous a combo platter, Alan. Alan, it's a, it was a combo platter of the Boston Crab camel clutch. I don't know how Outrageous could even get up. I think they're taking it home, Alan. Into the ropes. Oh! Double sidewalk slam. They couldn't get him up. Oh! Oh! That was a little adjustment there. I don't know how outrageous is a tremendous athlete wrestled many years all over the world, but I don't know how he can take this. I think he's feeling his cage on that one, Alan. <laughs> he is in pain. He won't be riding a bicycle seat very, very much lately. Now he's biting him. Anything he can do. The Ballers, they'll use their teeth. Objects, no, anything. No, no, he got some burrito juice on the mask. He was just tasting it. We definitely have Mexico versus Canada here. Like we say, anything can happen to the Battle Royal. Outrageous, very slow to get up. Well, Outrageous always was a little slow, mentally and physically. He's on his feet. He's got to go credit. He slipped, he slipped Ballard out. He slipped him out. That, that's experience, Alan. Good God. And that's experience, a backdrop over the top row. Two in a row. Talk about a comeback. The fans going wild. We got the USA and Mr. Outrageous, and we got Canada and the Ballard. Down to the, down to the final draw. Only one winner in this Battle Royal. Remember, only one. And I'm predicting, I'm predicting it's going to be Ballard. It's going to be Canada. He's definitely got him. This is it. Clothesline over the top. That's it. Uh oh, look out! Uh, he's setting rope. him up. Whoa! It backfired. He's down. He's out. Just what I call. Oh, look at the Mexican. He was never eliminated. He was just hiding in the corner. We just got to it. Talk about down the wire. He missed that one. Nobody home. Moonsault. It was a moonsault, Alan. A moonsault to the mat. And I think outrageous. That's it. Outrageous. Just like I predicted, Alan. Outrageous one. I predicted I it from the beginning. Ballard, but that's okay, John. Look at this crowd. They're on their feet. The crowd is so excited, Mr. Outrageous. No, I, mean, I think you're excited because I just stood up. Okay, John, whatever you say. What a tremendous and exciting battle royal. And your winner, he's hurt, he's tired, he's dazed. He's Mr. Outrageous. He sure is. In the ring, the, look at the kids, the crowd. They just love this guy, Mr. Outrageous, winner of the Battle Royal. And take a look at that beautiful championship belt. Everybody's in the ring for the celebration. Your overall 16-man Battle Royal winner, the one and only, Mr. Outrageous. Well, he definitely got this near capacity crowd behind him, Alan. Outrageous really pleased the people tonight. I'll give them that much. And John, that lovely lady in the ring, too. I suppose you're going to give her your phone number also. I already did, Alan. I already did. <laughs> and she tore it up already, too, John. I bet. Outrageous, really. I mean, the man's got to be so excited. He's put in many years of the business. He's wrestled all over the world. Just returned from a couple of weeks in Japan. Wrestled in Mexico also earlier this year. Just amazing. And look at that, he loves the crowd, they love him. People just going wild in this arena in Hollywood, California. Yeah, they're making a lot of noise in here, Alan. I can hardly even hear you. Well, outrageous is on top, no question. And John, we gotta admit, what an exciting battle royal. Only the UWF can bring it to you like this. Let's go back and see an instant replay. There's a slam. You'd think he'd be done for the night. That was the double hip toss, Alan. That's right, the punishment Outrageous took earlier in this event and to make such a tremendous comeback.
And a big backdrop here, Alan, that zaps all the air out of you. And just came to me, Alan, the Ballards told me before the match they were going to use the 10 minute misconduct. That's what they call that hole. What a move. Talk about exciting wrestling action. That 16 man battle royal was unbelievable and won by Mr. Outrageous. My former tag team partner, Mr. Outrageous, threw the Mexicans out like yesterday's burrito. Oh, come on. Threw the Aussies out. I gotta give Outrageous a little bit of credit. He learned a little something, but I still got a little bit more to teach him. And when I see him, I just might teach Mr. Outrageous those final few pointers. Oh, is that so? Well, take a look. Here's Outrageous right here. Oh, sorry, John. Kind of cut you off guard there, huh? Yeah. Thanks for watching, everybody, fans. Points. Psycho Johnny Painted Alan Bolte. See you next time. It's been your pleasure. Big T. Now, Big T, tonight, you're in this big battle royal. You're obviously the biggest, baddest man in this That's battle right. royal. You're going to be a target. What's your strategy for tonight? Well, you know what? I don't have a strategy. You know what? I'm going to take it to these guys tonight. You know what? Big T's going to kick some butt tonight. All right? You better not. Don't, don't come close to the ring. You want no piece of this guy. Okay? I'm out here for Mr. Outrageous. But you know what? Forget Mr. Outrageous. Big T's going to win. Mr. Outrageous, where'd he go? Hey, hey, what do you want? Nice time, faggot. <laughs> I am Mr. Outrageous, shut up. 14-time professional wrestling champion here, Hollywood, California. Tonight, UWF, we are crowning the professional wrestling king. 
Now, does it get any bigger than that? Probably not for you people. For me, oh yeah. I've done it all. Movies, TV shows, rock videos. Hey, I was Eminem's video, the comeback one, without me. When he said the best thing since pro wrestling, yeah, he was talking about me. They were showing me Toby Keith, as good as I once was. Well, that's his story. It ain't mine. I'm good every time, every day, every way. So tonight, you know what you're going to see? Mr. Outrageous, the new king of the UWA. Yeah. Can we get this what, one in just a minute? I need him to do Thank you. Okay. Right here. Good name? Moses Grimm. I don't have pictures with me, but I'll get them. You just let me know. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm here with Moses Grimm, another one of the participants tonight in this big battle royal. As you can see, another big man in this large battle royal. Now, you've got Aaron Aguilera out there. You've got Big T out there. I mean, what are Look you... Look here. It's all about Grimm. You hear me tonight? Yeah. UWF wing around my waist. I come here for one reason and one reason alone, to slap the crap out of Mr. Outrageous one last time to send that sucker packing into retirement. You ain't seen me. I've been in this business a long, long time, deep from the underground. You hear me calling you? Outrageous, I'm coming for you tonight, sucker. I'm going to get you. Okay. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm here with possibly two of the fastest participants in tonight's match. The possibly. Ballard Brothers, possibly. Team Canada possibly. themselves. Possibly. possibly. We don't need this guy to do it. Where do you get possibly from? We are the fastest team out there. We are the best team out there. And there's no other team in professional wrestling that can top us. That's right. We are from Canada. And if you look at the map or globe of the world, you will see that Canada is up here and the United States is down here. So that just means that we will always be above you. Are you talking everything? And I'll do the same my mother's from always. So you can ask the questions? Can ask yeah. questions? Okay. All right. Tonight here in the UWF, the monster himself, Black Metal, steps in the ring to win the King of the Wrestling Championship. Now, Suavecito, you've been training Black Metal for this match? I've been training and managing him, and that's the way it's gonna be from here on out. And here in the UWF, you're gonna find out who the top men are in this business. And here's the man that's gonna take everybody down tonight. You hear that? Tonight, my friends, all the Chivo Chasers out there, like dear pals, be with us, support us today. We take this battle royal home. This is Chivo time today, Chivo time tomorrow, Chivo time forever. We're here to prove once and for all that we're the best tag teams in the world. Wherever we wrestle, you got guys get your money's worth. Today, tonight, we're going to prove it in this battle royal. A todos los aficionados de la lucha libre, un saludo de aquí de los chivos, Emi Madior y Cayam. Les mandan saludo y les dedicamos este triunfo de esta tarde aquí en esta batalla campal. Chivo Power is here, Chivo Power is here to stay. Chivo Power forever. México. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm here with one of SoCal's legends, WWE, former WWF superstar, 
the hardcore kid. And hard kid you wanna know why I'm gonna win this battle royal? Why? You wanna know why I'm gonna win? Why? Cause I got the fives, baby. Look at that. I got the fives, baby. All these men in here, they're not men enough to get the fives. Look at these guys. Look at these guys. They got the threes. They got the threes. They can't handle the fives. They only got the threes. You can't handle the fives. You can't handle the fives, Gary. You can't handle the fives. You only got the threes. You see, I got the fives, baby. I got the fives. And the fives are going to take me to the top, baby. The fives are going to let me win this battle royal. Can you handle it? Can you handle the five? Hell no, you can't handle the five. That's right. That's right. You can't handle the five. Give me these five. You can't handle the five, baby. You can't handle the five. Ah, Yeah. Only I can handle the fives. Go ahead and talk shit across here. Are you on this side? Go ahead and talk shit across to each other. Hype it up. Hype it up. I don't know. Just follow. There you go. Provoke them. Provoke them. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm here with Nia Kennedy and Carla Jade. The only women's match on this Star Shutter show tonight. I mean, ladies, the pressure's on. I mean, it's building up. One of you guys has to make a good impression. One of you guys has to come out on top. And who's it gonna be? Well, that'll be me. No, of course it's gonna be me. What? I'm pretty sure of course you everybody here. Before you get your ring oh, I know how to wrestle. I'll show you you're how I know to how to wrestle. To everybody me. will see. Come and watch this girl get her behind kicks royally, okay? I'm gonna roll ass. Alright, you call your wrestling pulling hair, right? That's what you think? Sweetheart, I ain't gonna pull your hair. I'm gonna lay it into you. I know how to work the mat, I know how to work that ring. You ain't gonna get away just by pulling my hair, so. Am I supposed to be scared? I'm not, but of course, you should be. And I just have one thing to say to you don't take this ass whooping personally. That's all I have to say. Thank you. Oh. Excuse me. I don't think we're done. We're not. No. We're... Take it to the ring. What? What? That's it. That's right. I'll see you in the ring. I'll see you in the ring. I'll see you. Back up, back up, back up. What royally because I am the best and that's it. That's it. Thank you. All right. You're Ladies and gentlemen, I'm here with yet another participant in tonight's battle royal, Mr. Chip Hazard. Now, Mr. Hazard, tonight you've got guys from Mexico, you have guys from Canada, you got guys from Australia, you got guys from all over the world. What is your strategy going in tonight? Let me tell you something, man. I've been in this business a long time. Coming out of Fort Bragg, I've wrestled them all. I've been here, I've been wrestling for 20 years. I don't care, they're from Mexico, I'm from Canada. I don't care where they're from, it doesn't matter. Good old USA, that's what counts, brother. You better believe it. <laughs> 